Here we have a Ligier from 1981, a JS17, and it runs a Matra V12 engine, three litre V12. It gives about 500 horsepower we are in period. They used to rev a little bit higher than what we do now, but they used to give about 530. It's a, a ground effect car, so it has the Venturis. Uh, and in period they ran sliding skirts, but uh, for, for the races we use now in the Masters FIA F1, we have to have a ground clearance, which takes away some of the downforce. It was driven mainly by Jacques Lafitte, and it actually won the Austrian Grand Prix at Osterite Ring in 81. So it, uh, yeah, fabulous bit of kit. You have to commit you know, with the slicks and the downforce you get from the, the tunnels. You get a lot of downforce, which obviously equals a bit of grip. And, and it's all about commitment. It's just believing that it will stick, which takes a little bit of getting used to. They're a little bit clumsy in the slow corners because nothing really works. And they're a long, big car. But when, once you get on fast sweeping bends, they really come into their own. And the trouble is, the earlier cars, because they don't have the downforce, are so quick in a straight line that they pull away from you in a straight line, but then we're a lot quicker in the corner, but then you've got to get past them. Fantastic, you know, a fantastic car and, uh, yeah, and, a, and a great series to run in. So unlike modern Formula Ones now, that's all you got, done the one thing, nothing else on it. And in fact, in period, you wouldn't have been quick release. It would have been, you'd have to struggle to get in and more importantly, struggle to get out. And then obviously you have a gear lever. It's a mechanical car rather than an electronic car. So it's, um, yeah, it's all very simple. Just a rev counter, two gauges, royal water, fuel pressure, uh, oil pressure, a couple of switches, and that's your lot. Nothing gets simpler than that.